Episode 18 of the Justice League Animated Series. Let's get into it. Do you think you'll fit on that garbage scow? Definitely crazy. So he wants to rescue him. Okay. Sorry. Why do we have to ride in this rust bucket? What's wrong with your ring? Lady, the galaxy's a big place. I need my Navi computer to find War World. You got a point. Great. Is you? Thick headed? Why, you self righteous, green eyed. No. My attitude is just fine, except when you're involved. And another thing, just because you've got that fancy ring, uh. you a real. <coughs> Use your ring. Yeah, like me, you be beating from. Don't be like so much garbage, will you? But I won't forget you, Superman, or the shame of my defeat. Ah! If you rescued you, and now you want to kill you, maybe the others were right. There. Stop that! Days, and we don't even know how to get back to Earth. How much worse can it get? My ring could get us off this planet, but without knowing exactly where we are, we take the risk it'll run out of power before we find another habitable world. So we're stuck here. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, exactly. Maybe forever. Just the two of us? Yes. And we do have a great chemistry. Maybe I shouldn't have been so hard on you. You messed with the wrong guy. No one touches our stuff. there Draga that scar on your chest what about it I was just wondering our friend wears something just like it there it is oh so yeah friend with Superman I'm gonna destroy you too because what do you think in his mind it's a big place how will we ever find them? That's your problem. Its power can decimate a planet. And that's exactly what I would have done to Dragas if he hadn't cooperated. I can do the same to your world. My world is already gone. Krypton's already gone. No matter. Any planet will do. Even Dragas. You can't. Oh, really? Now listen and listen carefully. If you want that planet spared, you're going to have one last fight against me. And you're going to lose badly. Understand? Oh, I'll say yes, then I will actually win the fight. But I'm gonna beat you with him. Then you know. Doing making it convincing. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, That's good is making it convincing. Or do you think I'm being a royal pain? No, sire. Of course not. Good. Then do it before I. <coughs> Are you all right? Uh... What? Get him! Yeah, 
dar uma pia como é que me ligou e que foi a gente You destroy your world if you interrupt. You have to, or he'll destroy your planet. What? Don't you see? I promise to lose. You'd sacrifice your own life for my planet? It doesn't make sense. Now, Kryptonian, it's just you and me. Come on, John, do something. What, what are you doing? I don't care. Oh, yeah, right now. Super many can beat monkey. The idea in one thing. Then all bets are off. You're mine. Oh, yeah, right now. Mine. Okay, I can call the Drake again this. Okay, fine. You regret that Drake. This is for my people! And this is for my humiliation! And this is for justice! Go, oh yeah, yeah, also, you know, if that Draco wins... doesn't deserve the honor. Then it's over. Not yet. Here, you should wear Mongol's crown. Keep it. You've earned a chance for a whole new life. What's life without honor? I'm not worthy. Draga, the real test of honor isn't how you die. It's how you live. Be the king of this world and change things. So the 13th episode of Just the Weekend is quite an under amazing episode. I gotta say this act is really you know well written, enjoyable, you know. Yeah, it's just it's based well and everything about it is just amazing. I really was interested, invested in everything that was happening, you know. And that's what the episode should be like. And just speaking on Trey guys, like his character and how they do this thing, you know, especially his story. It's understandable that he, he was only fighting for his world. He didn't really want it to, you know, uh, to fight and be in this kind of person who just wants to fight and kill. He only did it so that he can save his world. 
to understand it because a, a hero in disguise you know you, if you just see him without understanding why he's doing it you just think he's a villain but i think they did a great job on establishing his character and making that story well understandable and you know more like a boss of a good job on that and you know the ending just made, made me think that would actually see Drega maybe in the future so yeah i'm really interested in what kind of a person he would be by then you know would you be the, like just a king or would be a superhero because it sounds like they are sort of setting him up to be like the king of our world and i think that would be really great if he becomes a, a king of our world and you know just change things around i mean he shouldn't, he shouldn't get rid of like the fighting things you know just you know he shouldn't get rid of that uh, but he shouldn't force people to fight he should just find people who are vol- want to volunteer in fighting then they should fight but it, it shouldn't be like a deadly kind of fight you know you know whoever wins wins and whoever loses loses but they don't have to die so i hope he kind of establish that kind of king you know, so a rule but yeah, i hope he doesn't take away uh, the fights you know boss those are just like their sports so yeah i hope that if he does become king he does keep those things you know so guess Anyway, that was my review of episode 18 of Justice League War World Part 2. I hope you like the reaction. If you do, make sure that you do leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.